see you over there. Barely. Should have waited. He'll be back. Maybe. Hopefully not with friends. It's dust. Hiding around the corner, isn't he? Fine, you want to do that? If I shoot one into the wall, he'll come out. No. She needs... She needs something that makes noise. doesn't have any friends hanging around on the other side there. Gotcha. Okay. Now we can hopefully have a peaceful look around. You know, Khajiit was just thinking. She's just been kind of assuming these creatures are hostile. Actually... Yeah, it's hard to say. Because I've also been assuming that it was the machines that's killed the researchers I found so far. And maybe it wasn't the machines. Maybe they did fine with the machines. Maybe it was these creatures that killed them. Maybe. Hmm. Oh, there's a door over there. Okay. I mean, these creatures are wearing clothes and they seem intelligent, but then so do giants, and Khajiit has killed the giant, and the giants have killed killed Khajiiti, so... Yeah. Ok. 
Khajiit has to get through here. She has things she has to has to find. So it's probably best to assume. Oh, this lock lock looks really tough. Oh yeah. This is going to really use up the picks. Okay, very delicate touch. Worth all these picks. Oh, she found us, found it. Okay. Oh, almost. Nope. So, which way? No, nope, wrong way. Let's try it there. Oh. Needs oil. Ah, oh, so close. Cause she did it, cause she did it. Oh, that was a hard lock. It's the hardest lock she's found yet. Oh. Well, we won't need that anymore. What is this? Hmm. More can stories. Master and Sektunda. Oh, the moons. Two halves of Lorcan. Yeah. Because she reveres the moons, but she doesn't think that what this person was reading is true. Not two parts of somebody's body. They are themselves. That was a lot of lockpicks. Hmm. So this fellow must have locked himself in here. Well, a person. There's no clothing left. So it was a very, very long time ago. I'm surprised the book was still here. And survived intact. She has to go that way, doesn't she? She's getting kind of tired, actually. What time is it? Oh, no wonder it's getting on to evening. She has been doing stuff all day. Okay. She's not done yet. How come you have three ears? Did you steal somebody's ear? Probably. She can have a look around. She probably need to refresh her spell pretty soon for her armor. But for the moment, oh, looks like there's some more ore. Hopefully, Khajiit's eyes will adjust here.
Door. All right. She can't get in here anyway, no. Do I hear little feet? Possibly from this room. Here's something. Oh yes, there's definitely something going on. Okay, I cast that one first, so if I put a second one here, that one's going to vanish. So let's recast this one closer to the door. And let's put the second one right in front of the door. That gives Khajiit somewhere to run. Question is, is it going to be one of these Falmer or is it going to be a machine? It sounds more like a machine. So, yeah, let's do this. Okay. Oh, the door is locked. Okay. Okay, close. Close. Wrong way. So what Khajiit heard was neither a machine nor a Falmer. She forgot about the third possibility. Oh. Ooh, look at that. Oops. Ah. She didn't mean to pick that up, but she meant to do inspect this chest, which is locked. Hmm. Okay, Sajira, pay attention to what, what you're doing. Really, an apprentice lock shouldn't take this many picks. Honestly.
Hmm. Anything up there? Not so much. I wonder. Would it be safe to sleep here? I mean, or would Kodoja get worried? Well, he'd probably get worried, but... I mean, if she trapped the door... She could probably sleep in one of these beds she's been finding. She may have to. If this place continues to be quite so big. It's amazing. Let's look at the dark corners. Okay. She may have to sleep here. Now, the question is, is why were you locked in there? I suppose that could be the... Could have been the researcher's way of dealing with some of the stuff in here. Just locking it away. Because well, she'd hope she's going the right way. She should be. She may be getting tired, but she's not... Uh oh. She does need to shut up and pay attention. Because looky, looky. Okay. You doing a patrol? Sort of. Hmm. Because she does a trap there, will that let's wait till you move a little ways away, hmm? Alright. Actually, Kajit has poisons that she's not been using. She's been finding these poison on these guys. Sure, why not? And since she's thinking of it. Oh, it is out of charges. The magic. Now that she's holding it, she can see that it is very... Um, there, now it ting tingles again. Alright. Now we're ready. Uh, where's my... Um, Okay, now Khajiit is ready. Where'd you go? You coming round? I hear your feet. You're coming around. Why can't I hit these guys? Well... It's one way of hitting them. Is that all? Okay. Hopefully that's all. Oh, you had a big sword, didn't you? And a staff. Khajiit will take that. Thank you very much. OK. 
Because you will borrow those things too. So maybe one of them was a a mage. Okay. Was fortunately being is that a door? I think there's a door up there. What is that? It almost, almost looks like water. I don't think it's water. Or is it water? Is it water? It's very clear. Very clear. Well, she will check it out here. What she sure? Oh, get here. A lock. Lock chest. There we go. Oh. Nice. Khajiit will have to disenchant that. Actually, she has a few things to give Kodojo. Disenchant and enchant new ones and then give them to Kodojo or herself. Cool. She can, uh, that's assuming she has the soul gems, of course. Uh, well, she's been finding a lot of empty ones. Um, she, I think she has found some full ones on these guy on the um, machines. I, I, she thinks that's their um, fuel. Because they all have them. Um, why is Khajiit blind and can't see anything? Soul gems. Oh no, Khajiit actually. She actually has more than she thought. Even some graders. She may be able to ma make some okay items. Pretty sure there's no one up there, so let's check this. It is water. It's just, wow, it is really clear. I guess that means the foamer aren't tinkling in it. Ew. It's a good thing that it's not very deep. Because you certainly wouldn't want to be walking in it if it was very deep. And of course, she had to step in it to find out it was water first. But yeah, let's get out of the water. Shake off the toes. Right. Well, yes, it's so clear. So it's not contaminated with anything, fortunately. What did the Felmer have been putting them here? A door? You know, maybe they had some kind of reverence for the the Dwemer. Because hmm. she don't think they were prop were there originally. It just doesn't seem a likely place. That's another big bug. Because he recognizes that sound now. Okay, so big bug behind door number two. And behind door number one. Because uh, you cannot hear anything. It's 
so I guess door number two it is. Right. He's behind there. He knows there's something up. Let's wait till he gets all quiet again. Maybe we'll get a free shot at him. With the bow or... Yeah, let's try the bow. Go to sleep, little bug. We're not so little bug. There isn't anything waiting out here for you, honest. Do bugs sleep? Hmm. Kishida's never thought about that before. Maybe bugs sleep. Maybe they don't sleep. Hmm. Well, Kishida will wait here for a little while and find out. Good night, little bug. Good night. Say, because she's just curious, did you like her video? Yes? Then please click the thumbs up button. Because she thanks you. Brrr.